RadicalPrep.com. Okay, the question says, in the figure above, what is the value of 3x? And if you want to get something like this right, you've got to know one really, really, really important thing, and that is how many degrees are in a line. And hopefully you said 180. And we can kind of remember that because we know that a circle has how much? 360. And this is just a semicircle, right? This is just half of the circle. So we know a line has 180 degrees. And if I take that a step further, and I took a line and I split it up into angle X and angle Y, and I asked you, what is angle X plus angle Y? You should say 180 degrees, right? Because they're still under that semicircle. So we can actually do the same thing in this problem. You don't have to do this on test day, but you might. You never know. It could help you. So what do we have under that semicircle that represents that line there? We've got x, x, and 110. So we can make an equation, actually. We can add them all up. x plus x plus 110. And you tell me what it equals? 180. All right. Now we're just going to go through the algebra of it, right? So we're going to minus 110, minus 110, cross that out, x and x. You've got 2x equals 70, 180 minus 110. I'm going to divide by 2 on both sides, divide by 2, and half of 70 is 35. And we're done, right? Wrong. Because what does the question want? It wants 3x, not x, so you got to be very, very careful on test day that you're actually answering the question. All right, so last step, real quick, 35, and we've got three of those, right? 15, 105, choice D.